There's a rising trend in coronavirus cases across the nation, and Mesa County hasn't escaped it. That's why the county was moved back into level orange of the safer at home phase on the COVID-19 risk dial, and it's impacting local business. CARE X5's Lena Takata tells us more, and she joins us live in studio with more. Lena. Adrian, health professionals say Mesa County is at high risk on the coronavirus risk dial. That's why starting this week, new protective precautions are in place. This means people can only gather in groups of 10 or less out of two households, and most businesses can only operate at a 25% capacity. Just a few weeks ago, Mesa County was in the protect our neighbors phase, the best phase on the state coronavirus risk dial. But now Mesa County is only one phase away from a stay at home order and it's impacting businesses. Grocery stores, hardware stores, uh, those are all considered essential services, so they don't have to restrict down to 25 percent. Businesses who are part of the five star certification program can still operate at a 50 percent capacity or have up to 100 people, whichever one is smaller. But for our local our local businesses, I think it's very helpful. Um, so and it allows us a chance to work closely with them so that they are truly implementing to the fullest extent those uh, those safety guidelines. The CEO of the Grand Junction Area Chamber of Commerce says because the holiday season is such a crucial time, the impact that the coronavirus pandemic has on local businesses could be worse than March. Um, this is when a lot of our businesses, particularly our locally owned businesses, generate uh, for up to 40% of their income is during the holiday shopping season. Schwenke says many local businesses have applied to be a part of the five star certification program and those who haven't still can. But currently the number certified is only upwards of about 130 businesses out of the roughly 4,000 we have in the county. Schwenke also says the best way the local community can support local businesses is to shop local. Um, it's uh, way too easy to jump online, but our small businesses need you now more than ever. And stay COVID compliant. And wear the mask, socially distance, and don't gather in crowds. We'll keep you updated on how the pandemic is impacting local businesses. First on the Western Slope, I'm Lena Takata, KREX 5 News. Adrian. Lena, thanks so much. In response